Kung Fu have 4,000 years, mm -hmm. yeah, and then tea have uh, almost 5,000 years, okay. the heritage. Okay. Both have a very long history. Yes, that's yeah. true, that's true. Yeah. So for, for, for Alex, how was the experience for you? The uh, experience is... Yes. Uh, you spend... Uh, no, at the start, it's it not easy to find the food and pairing the, the tea. Mm -hmm. But this time, I, I, I really learned about the tea is to be uh, matching the food or inspire the food. You, you should uh, consider the, 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 the food or the taste of the food first. Mm. If, if too strong, maybe you, 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 you can use a stronger tea mm -hmm. flavor, a tea leaf. Okay. Yeah. If there is a little bit uh, slight of food, you, you, you choose uh, a little bit stronger or uh, flavor is uh, different. Uh, the, the, the food. So it's uh, easy it's to try to and then you can find out. Mm. Yeah. So after finding out for so many months, yeah. what is one favorite food and tea pairing? Uh, that the, you like? the uh the uh we use the tea is uh Lua uh, uh -huh. Mandarin cream. Mandarin uh, cream. Okay. Uh the first the Ilua Ilua is a uh, very famous uh, one of the um, three uh, 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 district mm. in Sri Lanka. It's very famous, one of the three yes. district in Sri Lanka. So I chose this uh, tea to inspire um, my food. Okay. Yeah. So I also use the mandarin cream. It's a uh, very uh, sharp, a little bit salty and a uh, mm. little bit uh, mixed with uh, mascarpone. So yes. you just feel very creamy and a little bit strong uh, mandarin flavor like that. Oh, and good. after mixing the the luai lua leaf, mm. it's very, very balanced. You okay. know? And uh, on the other hand, the, uh, uh, one is a milk fui uh, dough. Is uh, the name is. Uh, uh, kuman, kura, uh, kura, ku, kuraman kuraman do okay. is uh, uh, from western uh, part of French. Okay. It's very famous and okay. this is very crispy, mm. crispy do. Yeah, okay. it's a serious. I uh, uh, use this to make a, a meal for it one by one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, it sounds like a lot of painstaking, yeah. uh, yeah. creamy slow, and then slow. crispy. Wow. <laughs> yeah, like in fighting in your mouth. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> sounds good. Yeah. So Ernest, what yes. about you? You have been working with a lot of um, teas yes. and using cocktails, mocktails, yes. and I saw some of the beautiful uh, cocktails you yes. did. Yes. You did there. So what are some of the things? Maybe one thing you've learned about tea and cocktails and mixology in uh, these few months. In these few months, mm. I learned some important thing about the brewing a cup of tea. Okay. Yeah, before we don't pay attention to the brewing time. Yes. Maybe just pour the water and keep it here and then go to the washroom. Mm -hmm. But the correct time is very important. Mm -hmm. For example, the brewing time is five minutes. Mm -hmm. So five minutes shop. If over one more minute, the tea will turn bitter. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If not enough five minutes, maybe two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. Yes. So the sharp time is very important. Okay. Yeah. That's good to know. Because just now it was very exciting having the timing. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. need to use, use the tea time out of the country. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So thank you very much for My your person. time. Thank yeah. you. Thank you.